Hey guys! Welcome back to my YouTube channel. So, I've been posting a little late uh, the past few weeks. Again, you guys are very consistent in letting me know about that. So, I felt like I should explain what's going on. And it's very similar to my other YouTube is hard video, except that this one is kind of like an acting is hard video. What is this? This looks like jelly, but it's not... Oh. oh. I have no idea what that was. And now it's in my mouth. First off, let's start with a positive note, because that's what everyone says you should do, right? So, let's hop on that train. I just got more awards for being an actor. Isn't that exciting? Yeah! Let's open them. I haven't opened them yet. I figured I might as well open them with you guys, since... There's no one else around. So, the first one, it says my name. I feel like I just got a diploma. Ooh! So these are from the Stage Raw Awards. I don't know if you can see them. And it says, it's an award for ensemble. Jason Caceres in Hit the Wall. Yay! I got an award. Mm. Mm, mm. This is my happy dance. I'd stand up, but I'm not wearing pants. Hey, hey, hey. That kind of rhymes. Let's roll this back up. I gotta get frames for these. Because if not, they're gonna go bad. Okay. They're gonna go bad. <laughs> As if they're food. You know what I mean. They're gonna, like, disintegrate or whatever paper awards do. Okay, so this next one is from Stage Raw Awards also, and it's for Best Ensemble Production of the Year. And it says my name. I am such an idiot. No wonder I have no friends. Not even my cat wants to be with me right now. I'm really excited, and I hope you guys are excited for me also, and not just like, stop showing us your awards, you freak. Because that's not gonna happen. On to what's been going on in my life these past few weeks. So luckily, because I had that role in Criminal Minds, I don't know if you guys watched it or not. Um, things have kind of been picking up a little, so I've been auditioning a lot. The past week I auditioned for uh, four different pilots. Pilots are kind of like the first episode of a brand new series, so it doesn't mean that the series is going to go on TV, but if someone at a network, let's say like ABC, or even Netflix, which is now a network, watches this one episode and likes it, then they'll order more episodes, and then it becomes a TV show. I auditioned for four of those, pretty much like back to back to back to back. Uh, then at the same time, I had commercial auditions, and then at the same time, I had a few other like co-star, guest star auditions. Uh, so last week was packed for me. Can't, like auditions take up most of your day. There's also not a lot of time for you to make money doing whatever else it is you do, whether it's YouTube, you can't post a video or you can't do your regular nine to five job because you have to call out all those days for your auditions or, well, you know what I mean. So it's kind of hard. Hey, there's my cat. Maybe he does want to hang out with me. Anyway, so, so it's kind of hard. Then you have the people that are like, oh, your life is not that hard. You just got paid X amount of money to be on CBS on Criminal Minds. Listen here, let me explain something to you about this. An actor's paycheck, while yes, it is a lump sum at one time for that one episode, you're not getting that lump sum again. So when you ask an actor, which you shouldn't, how much money they made on a project, that's just a one-time payment. That's what people don't understand. And yes, you get a little bit of money every time that episode airs again, but it is nothing at all even close to your initial paycheck. So, it's not that much money. It's not that much money because your next job might be months from now or years from now. Hopefully not years, hopefully not years. Please. Regardless, you should not be asking an actor how much money they make. Why do you care? Are they giving you some of that money? No, it's rude. You wouldn't ask your doctor how much money he makes, or a lawyer how much money he makes per case. I've had strangers ask me how much money I made on a TV show, and I'm like, I don't even know you. Like, why would I say that? That's weird. That's been my life as of recently, and I'm not complaining. I'm not. 
I am so glad that I've had all of these auditions. So glad, and I hope they continue because that means that I'm doing what I love. There is a possibility that I might book one of those. Oh, actually, I did find out that I booked one of the pilots a few days ago. I can't really talk about it too much um, because, you know, non-disclosure agreements. We have to wait and see if it's going to get picked up anywhere, but if it does, that could be really exciting. Who knows? I'll keep you guys up to date with that one. So what else What else was I going to say about acting? It's hard, but if you, if it's your passion and if it's something you really, really want to do, then do it. Full force. Go. You can't hack this. Oh my god, I just said it. Do it. And support your fellow actors. Support your local theaters. Because <laughs> then they give us awards. I don't even know if this video is going to make sense when I edit it. It was just a bunch of rambling and I just wanted to tell you guys what was up with my life and what I was feeling, you know? Sometimes it's a little rough going to all these auditions and then hearing back that you didn't get any of them. So... Keep on keeping on. Alright guys, well as depressing as that video was, uh, if you liked it, please remember to share, comment, and subscribe. Like me on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat, Vine, and Tumblr. hey -o! And come back next week for a new video. See you guys. What was that? What? Okay, whatever. Anyway, bye.